I wouldn't like being friend with Sam. Uh, hard to understand when he... Look, I've said this before and I'll say it again. I, I don't really want to talk about it because it's just like, you know what I mean? I love the dude, man. Like, you know what I mean? He's a funny guy. I think... Because well, I'm not a doctor, man. I'm not a doctor, so I don't even want to try. All I can say is that, like, sometimes... This is from my own experience. I'm not talking about anyone else. I'm talking about my own experience. Sometimes it's good to take a couple days off from streaming and just, you know, rest your mind. I think it's important. I think everybody agrees, too. You know what I mean? When you almost lose your life... I think that was Sam's first, like, car accident. The thing is, he doesn't understand when you're being sarcastic. He getting mad for little jokes... Uh, B. Danny, you hit the nail on the head. Like, once again, I don't want to go into it, but, like, you hit the nail on the head. And what I gained from the whole thing is that maybe, like, I think you, know, you might just be, like, too young. People always said that. Like, why are you hanging out with somebody who's 22, 21 years old or whatever? Maybe it's right. I always kind of brush that off. Like, well, we're, we're both streamers or whatever. I just think he doesn't have enough, uh, what do you call it, life experience, I guess. Anyway, once again, much love. Yeah, sarcasm, and it's an English-speaking form of humor. That's what I'm trying. I, like, look, I don't even want to talk about it. I think everybody kind of realizes that's already what the situation. And, yeah, that, you know what I mean? Whatever. This. <laughs> Yeah, I can't joke. Like, basically, you can't really joke with somebody who's not from an English-speaking country because they don't really understand, especially when you're drunk. Like, you know what I mean? So, it's not worth it to me. I'm not going to... I'm not going to waste mental brain power over some drunken fucking night that doesn't mean shit. You know what I mean? Life goes on. Life goes on. But... Officially, for the record, I love the dude. Uh, wish nothing but the best for him. I think the last thing I messaged him was, I think you should probably go see, like, go and try to get professional help if you are having any issues with the accident or whatever. So that's all I have to say about the whole situation. Dude needs to take time away from streaming to kind of digest everything that's happened. In streaming, I tend to only really remember the most important moments. Like, something that happened a week ago at the bar when we are drunk. I don't know, man. You know what I mean? But I'm not going to cry like a little girl. You know what I mean? Have a little gator skin. If you're going to be all emotional and get your panties all wet and shit like that, then don't, don't hang around me. You know what I mean? Don't hang around me. Yes, but it belongs to another... Yes, but it... He belongs to another culture. They get angry even for religious reasons, for example. Yeah. I, look, my final thing about it is this, man. Don't put words into my mouth, right? You know, that's basically it. If you want to try to ride the gravy train and try to make as much money as possible, thinking people are going to just donate to you for, like, being sad or whatever. Like, dude, I don't know. I, like, All I can say is much love to all of my friends. I love all of them. Uh, streaming is definitely takes a toll on the mind and you got to be a strong individual uh, to be able to be a streamer I'm always sad and no one donates to me dude like somebody literally sent me a message on Instagram saying like somebody's gonna try to milk situations for whatever like for how long like imagine milking a non situation for that long like it's just kind of way beyond me like I'm not on that level uh, you know what I mean? Crying about something stupid is like whatever. Anyway, I wish nothing but the best to him, and hopefully he can get over whatever he's dealing with. Sticks and stones may break your bones, but words will never hurt you. I have to end with that LOL. Does any of you guys know any streamer more affected by words than this man? This has to be the most ironic thing you've seen of him in a while.